Right, welcome to the Lockdown Lowdown. I'm Dev Sarni. While I've been doing these little lockdown interviews, I've got to speak to some of the best fighters out there. Today, I'm going to be joined by the guy who may be the biggest fighter of the lot. One of my favourite things is boxing. Tyson Fury is my hero. Every day is a challenge, a fight. Maybe that's why I like boxing. You have to be a fighter when you have your beer. Some days can get me down. The worst part of the day is having my dressing has changed. But I'm a fighter. I won't let EB beat me. I've got so much to be happy for. I love my family, my friends, my animals and boxing the most. I'm a fighter to my last breath. Deborah was set up to support people just like Mason. We're the national charity that supports people living with EB. We do that in two ways. We provide community support here and now, every day, from the moment a child is born. We also fund pioneering research at the best centres around the world, looking at improving quality of life and finding treatments that ultimately cures for EB. Deborah requires your help today and for the future. Together we'll fight EB, together we can beat EB. I'm delighted to be joined by Mason White and his mother Kerry. How are you guys? Good, thank you. Well, a bit bored, but um, yeah, we're, we're we're managing. Last time right. I um, yeah. Yeah, last time I saw you guys um, was just before Christmas. Remember, we had the uh, the public workout at Lakeside, and Tommy Fury was there, and Tommy Fury got in the ring with Mason. Remember that? Yeah. How was that for you? You had a bit of a like a stern face off with him, didn't you? Yeah, it is really good. Tyson Fury, his brother's your favourite fighter, isn't he? Yeah. Must have been, uh, you must have watched the Wilder fight and enjoyed that. Yeah, I did. About 10 times. Yeah. <laughs> is that how you're spending lockdown at the moment, just watching that fight back? Yeah. Now, we've just seen the video by Deborah. Um, it's, it's absolutely inspirational. Um, Kerry, do you want to just tell us a little bit about what Deborah is doing for you guys and, and how it's working? Yeah, basically, Deborah is a charity that supported Mason from birth. Um, whether that's um, they fund the NHS nurses that work for Great Ormond Street, so fifty percent of the wages are fun funded by NHS, and the rest is funded by Deborah. So, and we can we couldn't manage without. The Deborah nurses because um, Mason's condition is really really rare so to have people that are clued up and know all about the condition and to look after him we, we need that in our lives because it is it is a challenging condition it is something that we've had to take day by day we've had to learn the hard way with some things and um, without those nurses in our lives I, I, well we, we wouldn't have coped. And I bet every day is different no day is the same huh? Yeah, definitely. I mean, even with these lockdown challenges, Mason's got in his head what he wants to do every day, but depending on his skin, depending on his feet, depending on how sore he is, um, we've had to adapt things every day. He wants to do challenges, but like one day he wanted to do a boxing one, but he couldn't walk because his feet were so sore. So we did have to um, do like a few sit-ups and things on the floor. And um, yeah, it's, it's one of those conditions that it changes daily and you don't know you don't know what's ahead of you every day. It's, every day is different and you can't predict what's going to happen day by day. Well, it's good to see Mason looking well today and sort of smiling. And, um, yeah, yeah oh, he's, sure. he's always smiling. Yeah. <laughs> Has he been, um, have you guys been watching the Tyson Fury Instagram workouts as well? 
Yeah, yeah. He, he watches them every day. Yeah, I bet that keeps you busy too. Yeah. <laughs> So tell us about these um, these challenges. That the, the reason that you uh, you're doing it, I believe, is with the whole pandemic going on right now. Deborah's perhaps not getting the uh, the attention that it, it needs, and it, it needs our help. Yeah, I mean, we. I, I mean, I'm so active with doing stuff for charity all the time, and we're a bit sort of being in lockdown. Mason's obviously shielded because he's he's highly vulnerable to to getting um, coronavirus, so we have. To to shield him and we were just thinking what can we do to raise money to keep the charity obviously going um to keep the word out there to raise awareness and money obviously um and it, to be fair it wasn't my idea it was mason's idea to start doing a few things his favorite subject at school is pe and he's missing his friends and he's obviously missing pe and he want, he loves to keep fit school work is it's happening but not as much as it should do um, <laughs> <laughs> but um, the fitness side of things, he loves to get outside in his wheelchair. He loves to keep fit. He loves a bit of boxing with his dad, a bit of sparring with his dad. And we've got a little gym at our home. So he does do a bit with his dad. So um, that's keeping him going. So, yeah, it was, was his idea to do something maybe every day. Um, because the little things he does that doesn't look much to us is a big thing for Mason. So a few sit-ups or a few squats or just... Um, it's a big thing for him so that's a challenge for him every day and he said why don't we do something video it and raise awareness and hopefully raise some money towards the charity and keep like support the charity and keep it going oh that's absolutely brilliant and i've i've looked on the uh the deborah page and i've seen a couple of the challenges good stuff you've got a nice little setup there as well with you got someone's holding the pads for you is that is that your dad holding the pads for you yeah. and then you pop 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 <laughs> yeah so now I understand, bringing us to today, you have a challenge for boxers to join you in your workouts. Do you want to issue the challenge, Mason? If you boxers want to join me, come and challenge me. Wow, there you go. There we've heard it. The big call out from marvellous Mason White. Are there going to be any boxers that take him up on it? No ducking, no dodging. You've heard it from Mason. Can you keep up with him? Just, just one thing. He can do the box splits. He's literally hypermobile. So if any of these, he, he might be able to do the splits, but can the boxers do the splits? <laughs> can they do the splits? Oh, goodness me! I, I reckon that there's a very small percentage of boxers who can do the splits. Can you imagine Tyson Fury doing the splits? I can't. <laughs> that would be amazing. Well, there you go. There, there's, there's the big challenge. I'm sure plenty of our boxers are gonna try and join in, and this is all for a great cause. Um, Kerry, do you want to say anything else about the fundraising effort going on? How, how well is it going so far? Um, yeah, we, to be fair, um, we've got a really good um, support network in my area. So I've done, I, I didn't just give them a page and I put a target of £500. Within a week, we've got £2,000. And then um, Tom Holland, who's Spider-Man, raised, he gave a £10,000 donation in one lump sum. So we're over, I think we're 12 and a half grand nearly. Um, and that's in two weeks. So yeah, we, we're doing amazingly. And I just... It gives Mason a little reason every day because obviously he's a bit bored at the moment, not being at school with his friends. It's giving him a reason every day to do something. It's raising awareness, it's raising money, and it's keeping the Deborah charity going. And without the Deborah charity, we, we probably wouldn't survive because they are they are literally amazing. Yeah, it's it's a great cause. I know it's it's a cause very close to to Frank Warren's heart as well. He does the uh, the charity shows every year, and um, yeah. yeah, we're we're really behind it. And it's it feels like it's quite a close to boxing cause because of those shows as well. Yeah, definitely. Frank, we've met Frank I've met Frank quite a few times now, and he's um he's really really supportive. And yeah, we can't thank him enough for what he does. And obviously, Mason being absolutely boxing mad is. It's, he's benefit, benefiting from meeting all these people and going to boxing matches and and them getting on board with with the charity so that's great amazing stuff all right guys well i'll let you go i'm sure you've got um fury wilder two to watch back sort of 10 <laughs> to 20 more times today so um, yeah, yeah enjoy the rest of your day and thanks very much for speaking to us today okay thank you very much all right well there you have it mason white has issued the challenge to the boxers are they going to get involved do they dare get involved especially the stuff about doing the splits who could do the splits out there
can you do the splits? I certainly can't do the splits. Apparently Mason White can. So I'm keen to see him challenge all of you guys to doing the splits. This is a great cause. It's to help kids like him, anyone who's suffering with that horrific skin condition that he has, that he's been living with for his whole life. I'll be putting a donation link in the description, in the comments. Get involved and um, yeah, let's help.